my favorite color, and Blackie's her favorite color, so we went whoop him and created the plushie. And you guys can get them on HeyCuties.com, November 4th. Don't miss it. Now, if I'm going to create Sky a Roblox account, I'm going to need her birthday. But I'd be a bad friend if I don't remember her birthday. Wait, I have a cheat code to remember this because I made a video on her birthday. Okay, where's Sky's birthday video? Where's Sky's birthday video? Aha, here it is. Aha, that's it. This video came out on April 4th. Sky's birthday's April 4th. How could I have not remembered? So stupid. Okay, here we go. April 4th, and I know she's 12. That means her birthday was in 2010. Because it's 2022 right now, and yeah, that would make her 12. Okay, now we gotta create Sky a username. How about Sky is my bestie? What? Someone's already using it? Sky's already someone else's bestie? Oh. What the heck rhymes with Sky? Sky, my, Thai, lie, pie. What about Sky likes pie? Ah, someone's already using it. I feel like Sky would have really liked that one. What about Sky the cutie pie? No, oh, it's already in use. That was a great one. I really like that one. Oh, okay, okay, okay. What about Sky is my bestie forever? Yes, I can use it. I mean, Sky really is my bestie for forever. Should I make Sky a boy just to mess with her? Nah, she'd probably get mad at me. I'm just gonna make her a girl. All right, we're signing up. Okay, I'm sure we can all agree that this does not look like Sky. We need to give this noob a full makeover, a full transformation, a Sky formation. Okay, so since we're starting with a school outfit, we need to start with her hair. What do I even call her hair? Like ginger hair, red hair, orange hair? I mean, her hair does look pretty orange, so I'm just gonna put in orange hair. I mean, yeah, I think this is definitely the same shade of hair that Sky has. Now, at school, she likes to wear her hair down and straight. I'm sure she just wakes up right out of bed and just goes to school. I mean, I should probably give her a hairstyle like this, because I'm sure this is what her hair looks like when she wakes up in the morning. Morning. I'll give her the benefit of the doubt and assume that she brushes her hair in the morning. We can give her some cute straight hair just like this one. Okay, I don't know if Sky would literally ever wear her hair like this. Like, ever. It kind of looks like a Powerpuff Girl. It's like a superhero. Oh, Sky should dye her hair like this with a little blonde streak in the front. Okay, that would be adorable. Or even like this. Oh my gosh, maybe I can convince her. And she would be half blonde and half orange, so then she would be half of me. Ooh, this is cute. I think we should give Sky some curtain bangs, but why are these covering her eyes so much? How is she supposed to see the board at school? School. Okay, yeah, maybe not. Oh, should I give her a high ponytail? No, Sky literally never wears ponytails. Okay, this is Sky's regular hair. She wears this hair every single day. But I'm gonna change up the style just a little bit for today at school. Should I give her this hair? What the heck even is this? Oh my gosh, no, thank you. This looks like a hairstyle from like the 80s or maybe even the 70s, honestly. Oh, okay, I think I'm gonna go with this one. Cute little pigtails at the top of her head, too. I love this. And it's a perfect hairstyle for school because it keeps her hair out of her face. Yeah, we're buying this one. Now we're gonna need to give her like a school uniform. Do they have any blue school uniforms out here? Ah, there's some here. Okay, there's this one we could use. Kind of cute. Or we could use this one. It kind of looks like a sailor. I'm not really digging it. Uh -huh, uh huh. How about this one? Oh my gosh, this literally looks so preppy. Okay, yeah, she would for sure hate me for this. Okay, this school uniform really got me. Honestly, I think it was just because of the bunny. Okay, I'm gonna buy this one, and apparently it also comes with the matching pants down here. So we're gonna see what those look like. Oh, it's perfect. The little socks. They even have bows on them. We're buying it. It's a done deal. Oh my gosh. Look at this hair right here. This is absolutely insane. This is 60s dolled up do in ginger. I would literally die if I gave her this hairstyle. She'd be mad at me for so long. She'd probably never even talk to me again. This is like a fashion nightmare. Now, Sky really likes to wear bows in her hair. So I'm going to search up blue bows. Now, I could give her the cute little bow hair clip like this one. But it's looking a little teal to me. Ah, this is too little for Sky. She just needs something more big. Big and obnoxious. Like, this is very big and very obnoxious. I mean, look at it on her head. It pretty much covers the whole back of her head. I mean, I think it's perfect. I'm gonna buy it. We're going with it. Okay, search blue school. What do people even bring to school that is blue? I mean, she can use these headphones to block out all the other noise from all the other students. The heck, are these bunny ears for a human or for a bunny? Yeah, I don't really know if this fits Sky's aesthetic. What about a backpack? Sky needs a blue backpack. Like, it's a must. Oh, this Game Boy backpack is so so cute. I mean, look at this. This is not what a real Game Boy looks like, is it? I used to have a Game Boy, fun fact. But honestly, where the heck are all the blue backpacks at? Am I blind or are they just like literally not here? I mean, I guess she could use the axolotl backpack. 
Yeah, I have literally no idea how to say this word. I don't even know what the heck this is. Is this some sort of creature? Okay, I don't know why the straps look like this. Why are they looking so stiff? Now, but this backpack is so cute. It has little strawberries on it. Sky loves to go strawberry picking. Oh, yes. I think this is a perfect backpack for her. I think she's gonna love it. Wow, I'm like giving Sky a whole new wardrobe. I think she's gonna be very happy about this. What about blue glasses at school? Maybe they'll make her look smarter. Influencer glasses? Are we really calling Sky an influencer now? All right, fine. We'll get them, but only because they look cute. Oh my god. Gosh, a blue friendship necklace. <gasps> she can wear one half and then I'll wear the other half. Oh, this is so cute. Yes, this really does show our true friendship. I used to get these for my friends like all the time from Claire. And I say all the time because I had a lot of best friends, okay? Okay, it is now time to put Sky's whole school outfit together and I will see you guys at school. Oh my gosh, I literally look just like Sky. I wonder if Sky's at school yet. Oh boy, this is gonna be fun. Oh, hey Sky. Oh, hey Sky. Wait, I'm Sky. How are you, Sky? Ah, I traveled back to the future, and now there's two of me. Ah, ah. No, no, that's not what's happening. Hey, sure, future me. I've got to figure out a way to get you, I mean, me, back into the future. Sky, it's me, Mackenzie. I'm just dressed up like you. What? Wait a minute. It's today Halloween. Oh, man, I forgot to dress up as you. No, I'm just doing a challenge where I dress up like you. Whoa, go off, girl. You nailed it. Oh my gosh, I just got a genius idea. Let's go to Ashley's party tonight and mess with her mind, cause there'll be two of me. Genius, Sky. Okay, I'll meet you there at eight. Don't forget your party dress. <laughs> okay, now it's time for me to get ready for a party as Sky. Now I gotta make her hair do a little bit more fun this time. We need some type of party orangey hair. This might be a little too long for Sky. It might just get in her eyes and her mouth. I mean, look at this girl. She can hardly see. Ooh, wavy mermaid hair might be cute for Sky. It's cute, but it doesn't really fit Sky's personality. I'm sure Sky would love for this to be her hair. Her hair made out of ice cream. A messy bun. Uh, this kind of looks like a ballet dancer. What about these bubbles in her head? I don't think the bubble braids are a very good look for her. I think we need something that is simple, yet still cute. Ooh, what about these waves? Kind of similar to the other ones, but I like this middle part way better. That is so cute. I just bought them. I think Sky needs to curl her hair more. Now, Sky told me to put on my party dress, which means she probably wants me to put on a blue party dress. So let's see what kind of blue dresses they have. I mean, this 3D one is very party party. What the heck? But why does it look so whack on her? Oh, this is a ballerina outfit. That's really cute. What the heck? It looks like she's wearing Uggs on her feet right now. Now, this dress looks like she's going out to a very fancy restaurant. And this pop star look might be a little too much for just a party at Ashley's. This cowgirl outfit is cute, but again, not really Sky's vibe. Ooh, I really like this ruffly dress, but maybe more for like a midday tea on a Sunday, not for like a party at night. Aha, I think I'm gonna go with this Barbie dress. This is so cute. And it comes with a heart necklace, so that's a plus. Oh, that is so cute and perfect. I think Sky will love this dress. Yeah, we're getting that. Now we need some blue clips for her hair. Should we go with the glittery clips? Or maybe the heart clips? Ooh, I like the star clips. It's a little bit more party-esque for me. Yeah, we're getting these ones. Yeah, what else do people wear to parties? I mean, maybe not a party hat. Well, she's going to a tea party, she could bring this. Or if it was a birthday party, she could bring the present. But it's none of those things. Wait, they have a disco party here? Oh, that is so cool. This guy's literally gonna be busting out those dance moves on the dance floor anywhere she goes. A party blaster paint gun? Oh, I would be so mad if someone blasted me with one of these. Yeah, no thank you. That would ruin my hair, my makeup, and my outfit. Oh my gosh, this hair is so cute. I've never seen this hair before. Oh, I am just kidding. Why does it look like she has bald spots in the front in her head? Okay, Sky's gonna need a purse to this party. Ooh, this is a cute purse. It's a fuzzy one. <gasps> I love this. It kind of reminds me of Christmas time. Oh no, this fluffy shoulder bag here is so cute. Oh no, this is the most ultimate cuties bag. Look at this thing. This has Sky's name written all over it. We're so buying that. Can I give Sky some like dramatic makeup? Yeah, you're right. I should definitely not do that. And we need to give Sky's a necklace for her party. She always needs jewelry. Oh, I like the flower necklace. It's so pretty. Oh, yes. This is gonna be perfect for the party. Okay, I think I've got her whole outfit. Now I just gotta put it all together. <laughs> Sky is totally gonna freak when she sees me. All right, Sky. Ready to do this? Oh, yeah. This is the best night of my life. Go for 
a good tanning session? Perfect! See you tomorrow! Well, I think we destroyed Ashley while making two skies, but now we gotta get ready for the beach. We need to find Sky some cute beach hair. This hair is really cute, but it says farmer girl, so maybe it's not perfect for the beach. Is this her hair, like, tied in a knot at the back? I mean, this would be a skill if you can tie your hair in a knot. She could also have her braided at the beach. That could be cute. What the heck is this one? This one's called lush coconut waves. What the heck is a coconut wave? It looks like a coconut is on her head. I can't even see through those bangs. Oh, this one is perfect. Clipped summer updo. That's literally perfect for a summer day at the beach. Look at that. Sky is ready to go swimming in the water. Yeah, we're buying this one. Yeah, what about for her outfit? Should I put her in a blue bikini? Or maybe she would do, like, blue beach wear. I'm not really sure. I mean, I'm sure I could figure it out, though. Sky is my best friend. Ooh, this bikini top is really cute. Is that, like, crochet? What? I want this. But let's be honest, Sky would literally never wear pink. I mean, it's her loss, not mine. Okay, I think Sky would love this top. I mean, she loves Hawaii flowers. And this is literally, like, a Hawaiian shirt. Oh, this is so adorable. She would kill this. Okay, we're getting it. And I wonder if there's any cute, like, matching skirts skirts for her. That would be adorable. There's some boy beach shorts, but I don't know if Sky would appreciate that. Is this a shark outfit? Imagine dressing up as a shark in, like, the ocean. Now, that would be creepy. Aw, this is also a cute summer dress for Sky. Oh, stop it. Are these matching pants? Did I find them? Wait, are these Moana's pants? Why does the description say there's another reason to watch Moana? Are these Moana's? Moana is literally Sky's favorite show. I think I have to get them for her. Sky always freaks out at me if I go to the beach and don't have a floaty, so obviously we have to get a floaty. She's probably gonna want a blue floaty, so I either go with the pool floaty in blue. This one's just kind of plain and boring. Or I could go with the floaty with the rubber duckies in it, and I feel like Sky would appreciate that. What about a cute little Hawaiian flower in her hair? I feel like that would look adorable. Oh, we could give her a blue flower crown. Look at these flowers. These are cute. Wait, they kind of look like ears, though. I don't know why they poke out so much. What the heck is this little flower baby? Oh, the flower baby to sit on my shoulder like that. It's like a devil or an angel just sitting there there right on your shoulder dictating decisions you're gonna make in your life <gasps> i have to buy this flower necklace for sky it's a must it's a must she'll love it the flower headband is gonna match her outfit perfectly it would be a crime for me not to buy this all right it's time to put it all together let's see this cute beach outfit <laughs> now i'm ready for some fun in the sun what the heck how did you know exactly what i was gonna wear to the beach sky i'm your best friend i'm pretty sure i know more about you than you know about yourself oh yeah you're right. Anyways, I'm getting pretty hungry. Want to order? Hot wings? Yeah, I already got them. Oh my gosh, you really do know me that well. Come on, Sky. Let's go on the yacht and eat some hot wings. Right behind you, girly. <laughs> now, since we need to create Ashley a Roblox account, we need to do some Ashley investigating. Now, Ashley has made quite a few appearances on my YouTube channel. And since she's in middle school, I'm going to assume that she's about 12 years old. Now, I don't know her exact birthday because she would never invite me to her birthday parties. But I'm going to go with somewhere in February. And the date, let's see. I'm going to go with 26. That sounds about accurate. And since she's 12 years old, she should be born in 2010. Perfect. Now, we need to create Ashley a username. I mean, honestly, I think she just deserves Ashley the bully. Oh, it's not appropriate. Oh, so she can bully me, but I can't call her a bully? Okay, sure. What about Ashley the meanie? Oh, it's already in use. What about Ashley the big baby? Oh my gosh, I can literally use it. That's exactly what I'm calling her, Ashley the big baby. Although normally she calls me a baby and makes me cry and then I just want to go home. Seems pretty accurate though, Ashley the big baby. I really dig that. Hopefully she doesn't get offended when she sees that. Oh, I don't care if she gets offended. <laughs> All right, now this is not what a mean girl looks like. This girl actually looks very friendly. I bet you if Ashley saw someone like this in real life, she would literally just make fun of them. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of this whole outfit because she needs an outfit change. Now, I feel like a lot of mean girls have blonde hair. I have blonde hair, but I'm not a mean girl. At least I hope I'm not a mean girl. But this is just a very stereotypical mean looking girl. Oh, California girl hair. We could just do it with the blonde straight hair. Or when the hair is tucked behind their ears like this. Oh, that is when you know they're a mean girl. Note to self, I will never tuck my hair behind my ears again. All right, what about this hair here? A high ponytail? Nah, I feel like this girl would actually be very nice and friendly. But this hair, on the other hand, looks very preppy, like a kind of girl who thinks she's all that. Oh, when the hair is flipped up at the ends like this? Oh, that's when you know they are unapproachable. But this, this is the most ultimate mean girl 
natural hair, half up, half down with a black ribbon in the back. And this is Ashley the big baby's hair. Oh, it just makes me angry looking at it. Okay, I'm gonna buy it anyway. Oh, this hair just makes me fume because it reminds me of Ashley so much. Anyways, okay, I need to find a mean girl outfit. All right, I'm searching that mean girl. Let's see what's gonna come up here. Oh my gosh, a lot of these outfits are actually from the movie Mean Girls. I mean, yeah, I could definitely see a mean girl wearing this. Or maybe even like an off the shoulder sweater. What, are they too cool for school? They can't put it on their shoulders? A frog t-shirt? I mean, it's cute, but I don't think a mean girl would wear this. An off the shoulder designer Chanel shirt. Oh, any mean girl's dream is this shirt. I'm getting this. I think this will be perfect for Ashley's school outfit. I'm gonna search mean girl pants. I don't know if anything's gonna come up here. Oh, we got a lot of short skirts. Some ripped jeans, pretty typical. Some juicy couture track pants. Oh, and they got a belly button ring. You can't forget the belly button ring. And the juicy word on the booty? Oh my gosh. Okay, I feel like Ashley would definitely wear these pants. Let me look for some more though, just in case. She probably wouldn't dress like a cute preppy school girl, but this is way up my alley. Some tattoos on the side of her leg. Okay, I don't know if Ashley would do that. Yeah, exactly. See, it's more of an emo girl outfit. Oh yes, I think the plaid skirt is gonna be perfect with this outfit. Honestly, I think the plaid skirt is very cute, but with the Chanel top, it's gonna be a mean girl outfit for sure. Okay, we bought it. And now she needs some accessories. Now when she goes to school, Ashley doesn't normally carry a backpack. She normally carries a purse. Let's see what kind of mean girl purses we got here. Oh, this purse is really cool. It's also definitely something Ashley would probably carry. Or maybe not. Maybe it's not like bougie enough for her. I mean, I like it. I would use it. Exactly. Ashley needs something more like this. Pink luxury pearl purse. Or even this one. Fashionable pink shoulder purse. A donut purse. This is amazing. Imagine if you could just eat your purse. Eventually, you just wouldn't have a purse anymore, though. I don't know if Ashley's into donuts as much as I am, though, so maybe not good for her. Oh, now this purse is amazing for her. Look at this purse. It's very cute, but it has Mean Girl written all over it. Like, look at that side purse here. She doesn't need a backpack. She is way too cool for school. All right, we're buying it. And she for sure needs some clips in her hair. Oh, these little flower clips are so cute. Oh, the white pom-pom headband. Okay, Ashley would literally never wear that. I don't know what I was thinking. The butterfly clips. These are amazing. These are so adorable, but are they too wholesome for Ashley? I don't know. I feel like if I wore these to school, Ashley would probably be making fun of me. I think I'm just gonna go with regular pink glitter clips because she's just too cool for school for everything else. Okay, this is how they look. I mean, I know she has the bows in the back, but she also needs some clips in the front. So yeah, we're buying these. What about a Starbucks? Do they have like a Starbucks cup on here? Oh, here we go. Just regular cups I typed in. She seems like the type that needs a coffee in the morning because I feel like if she doesn't get her coffee in the morning, then no one's having a good day. This coffee cup is cute. Okay, where does this go on the person though? Oh, just right at her mouth. Okay. I mean, maybe she's just running in late to school and just needs to bring her coffee and just hold it right at her mouth. <laughs> oh, and I can't forget Ashley's mean girl face. Okay, let me find it here. This is like if you want to be a mean girl, you literally need this face. Aha, here it is, the classic female face. Look, it just looks so sassy. Ah, just looking at this avatar gets me fuming. Okay, we're getting it. Oh, the face is free, so that's a plus. Good, because I don't want to spend much more Robux on Ashley anyways. And Ashley would never be wearing glasses. She's probably wearing like contacts or something if her eyes are bad. I also could see her wearing some headphones, you know, to block out all the haters. Oh, and I need to make sure I put Ashley in her own little circle because we all know Ashley needs her personal space. You get too close to her and she might just bite you. Okay, that's perfect. I'll get these because then everyone will know that we need to stay at least one foot away from Ashley at all times. All right, I'm gonna put this all together and then I will show you my school girl mean look. <laughs> Okay, now if I don't look like the meanest girl in the entire school, then I don't know who is. Ashley, Ashley, whoa, cute outfit. You're lucky your parents take you shopping. I have to wear the same outfit every day. Aw, it's okay, Ayla. Your outfits are cute too. Wait, Ashley, are you being nice to me? You've never been nice to me. Are you feeling all right? Oh, uh, yeah, I feel totally fine. Anyway, Josh is having a party tonight. You want to go? A party? I've never been to a, I mean, Yes, duh, I wanna go. Cool, all right then, I'll see you there. Oh my gosh, Ayla actually thought I was Ashley the bully. Maybe I'm doing better at this than I thought. Okay, now I've gotta get myself ready for a party. <laughs> 
Okay, now if Ashley is going to a party, what would she wear? I guess I just have to think what a bully would wear to a party. Probably just like a party dress. Okay, let me search it up. Let's see what we got. Oh, these dresses are really cool. These are the 3D dresses though. How is it gonna look at my body? Is it gonna fit my figure? Or shall I say Ashley's figure? Okay, I don't know if this is doing anything for her body. Okay, what kind of party dresses they got going on here? We could do a long dress with a slit down the side like this one. This looks a little too formal though. I feel like Ashley would not wear that. Kind of more like a mom dress. And this dress makes it look like Ashley's going to a club. And Ashley is not old enough to go to a club, so we're not getting that one. And this one looks like a prom dress. Although it's really pretty. I love the sparkle on it. Oh, now a cheetah print dress. Now, I feel like you could catch a mean girl wearing some pink cheetah print. Wait, but I kind of like pink cheetah print. Oh my gosh, am I calling myself out here? Okay, what else do they got here? Ooh, this floral dress here is really pretty. Oh, I also like this checkered one. But I'm more so shopping for me than Ashley. Okay, I need to stay on the task here. Come on, Mackenzie, focus. Wait a second. Ashley's favorite color is green, which is like a mean color. So I think I'm gonna need like a green dress. Oh yes, this is right up her alley. Okay, we could do this green dress. Uh, it doesn't really fit her vibe though. I think she needs something like silky. This is a cute green dress. Wait, but it says it's cottage core? And it says kawaii. She is definitely not kawaii. She is just straight mean girl. That's about it. She needs something simple yet elegant. What am I talking about? Ashley is not elegant at all. Should I just put her in the coco melon baby onesie? I should honestly just do that and make a fool out of her. Is this grass? Why does this look like a grass outfit? Ew, I do not like that at all. It looks like seaweed. Now this. This is a perfect Ashley mean girl outfit. <gasps> it has matching sleeves down here too. Oh, it's inspired by Maddie from Euphoria. And Maddie can sometimes be mean. Okay, we're totally buying this and I also have to get the matching sleeves. Ooh, the sleeves are sparkly. Very up Ashley's alley. I feel like any mean girl loves a good sparkle. Now I'm gonna give Ashley a new hairstyle. Cause maybe she wants to do it a little extra special for a party. Cause she needs to like curl it or straighten it or something. She can't just be doing her regular old school hair. Ooh, this one's really pretty. Maybe she went to the salon and got her hair done. Definitely something a bully would do for a party. Oh my gosh, yes. This looks very mean. Like, why does she just look so unapproachable right now? Or even this. I'm telling you, it's the hair tuck behind the ear that is giving it that bully vibe. I think this is perfect. This is actually very well, actually. It's slightly different from a regular hair, but not too far off. Okay, yeah, we're getting it. And bullies also have a different purse for every occasion. Whether they're going shopping, different purse. Going to school, different purse. Going to the library, different purse. Ooh, my I kidding? Bullies don't go to the library. Ooh, look at this white purse right here. It'll match her outfit. The white and gold is perfect. If you want to find a mean girl purse, all you have to do is find the smallest purse possible. Pretty much you're looking for something so impractical that you cannot fit anything in it, especially your phone. So yeah, I think this is one of perfect. This is this will do. Okay, I think Ashley's all ready for her party. Let's get her outfit together. Okay, I look like such a stuck-up rich girl, but that's exactly what Ashley is. Anyways, off to the party I go. What is up, party people? The party can now begin because I'm here. Uh, Ashley, what are you doing in my house? Uh, Ayla said there was a party here. A party here? No, she must have mixed that up. You know Tosh from school? Well, yeah, he's having a beach party tonight. Tosh, Josh, ugh, yeah, I can see how she could have mixed that up. Anyways, I'm leaving right now. Want to come to the beach party with me? You want to come with me? But, uh, don't you like Mackenzie? Uh, yeah, I just wanted to see if you needed a lift, but now you made it weird, so you can walk there. Bye! Oh, gosh, I almost blew my cover. Well, I guess I got ready for the wrong party. I guess I gotta get a beach outfit on now. <laughs> a bully beach outfit. Jeez, okay, I think we should start with the hair. When mean girls go to the beach, I feel like they wear their hair up in like ponytails. But not like a ponytail because they want to keep their hair out of their face. A ponytail because they just want to look cute. No, not this ponytail. This ponytail does not look cute. It looks very crazy. Something like this is perfect. She's got some hair clips in her hair. She's trying to make this ponytail look effortless, although it probably took her like three hours to do. Okay, yes, this is the perfect hair for Ashley at the beach. We're buying this. Ooh, there's a 3D big Bikini? What does this look like? Oh my gosh, it literally looks like I'm wearing underpants. Why does it look like that? Why does it look so big on me? I feel like a superhero with these on. And what about this bikini top? I do not have much hope for it. Oh my gosh, no thank you. This is terrible. Okay, bye. All right, now what would a bully wear to the beach? I mean, definitely. 
definitely a bikini if she wants to go swimming. But do bullies really go swimming? Or do they just go to the beach to look cute? These are questions that I need answers to. Ooh, this bikini is really cute. Okay, I feel like a mean girl would definitely wear this with a necklace too. Oh, geez, there's no matching bottoms linked. I don't know if I'm gonna find them. I'll buy it for now and see if I can find them. Oh my gosh, some of these bikinis are very little. Oh, this is so cute. I feel like this is something a mean girl would definitely wear. It's like a bikini outfit, but it has a little skirt to tie. Oh, they're called a sarong. Oh my gosh, it's so little. But I guess that's what you wear when you go to the beach. Okay, Ashley would definitely wear this. We're buying it. Okay, I think I'm gonna give Ashley a beach floaty. Ooh, these are so cute. Do you think she would like, like the donut one here? Oh, that's very cute. She looks like she's about to go down a water slide. It might look weird now, but she will thank me later when she's floating in that lazy lake. And then finally, I think she needs a cute flower in her hair. Because every bully has got to have that cute little flower accessory in their hair. They're trying to stand out in the crowd. They're trying to be trendsetters. Ooh, I think this pink flower is perfect. But maybe pink is trying too hard. Maybe she just needs a simple white flower. Oh, uh, not a white flower in the mouth. That is so weird. This is the one I was looking for. The white flower in the hair. These mean girls, they want it to seem like she just found it on the street and picked it up and put it in her hair. All right, we're getting this. This is perfect for her. All right, her pool party outfit is complete. I'm gonna put it all together. <laughs> Now this is the most perfect beach outfit for a bully. Oh boy, not you, Ashley. Please don't try bullying me. I'm just here to hang out at the beach. Guys, guys, it's me. Huh? Who's me? It's me, Mackenzie. Uh, 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 Ashley, I am not falling for any of your tricks. Mackenzie does not look like a bully. No, Sky, it's me. Today I decided to dress up like Ashley, but it's me. You can trust me, bestie. Oh my gosh, Kenzie, wow, you're so good at that. You should dress up as me next. <laughs> Wait, that's kind of a genius idea. Anyways, now that you're at the beach, wanna come hang out with me? You duh, let's do this. Oh, boy, I have got to remember when Josh's birthday was. Okay, let me think, let me think. Yeah, no, okay, I can't think of it. But I did make a video for his birthday, so let me check the video. Aha, here's the video here. Okay, this video was made on April 2nd, so that's when his birthday is, April 2nd. Okay, I'm changing Josh's birthday here to April 2nd, and I know that he is 10 years old, so that means he was born in 2010. Now, I've got to think of a good username for him. What about Josh, my crush? I mean, that seems pretty logical. Wait, that's not appropriate? Having a crush is not appropriate? Wow, now I'm in crush shame. What about Josh the cutie? Because he really is a cutie. Again, not appropriate? Wait, you can't be cute and play Roblox? What about Josh the baddie? Because he's a bad boy. Oh my gosh, I don't understand how that doesn't work. Maybe it's the name Josh. Am I not allowed to use the name Josh? What about Josh with two H's? Josh the cutie. Yes, I can use it. Oh my gosh, that is perfect. I mean, he really is a cutie. My cutie. Now, I normally only make girl accounts, but today we're making Josh an account. And he's a boy, so we're making a boy account. <laughs> What the heck? Is this what a fresh boy account looks like? Look at this guy. He looks like a noob. He's got a bacon head. His hair looks kind of delicious. I do want a bite of it. The man body is just so much bigger and bulkier. And right now, he does not look like Josh, so we need to get rid of this entire outfit. And we need to change his skin color, because Josh is a pale white boy. Okay, first, we're gonna start with his hair. We need some jock-looking hair. So if I just type in blonde hair, is it gonna show me all the boy hair? What the heck? This is the clothes section. Okay, what's going on? Oh my gosh, most of this hair is girl hair. Girl hair takes over everything. Maybe I have to type in boy. Blonde boy hair. Okay, this is it. And Josh is a blondie, so we obviously have to find a cute blonde blonde hairstyle for him. I like this hairstyle. It kind of reminds me of like a little preppy boy. Look at that. He's kind of cute. Also slightly nerdy. I feel like a jock would not have this hairstyle. He needs shaggier hair like the TikTok boys. Ah, oh my gosh. This is way too shaggy. You can't even see his eyes. It looks like there's a mop on his head. He needs something to like flow to the side where they just like flip their hair and it's like all cute, you know? Again, this one is just way too flowy. There's too much flow going on here. What about this one? Maybe you can at least see his eyes. Let me try it on. Okay, I can see his eyes. It's kind of cute. I feel like a jock would definitely have hair like this. He for sure uses hairspray in his hair to make those ends flip up like that. Sometimes a boy's gotta do what a boy's gotta do, though. Now for an outfit. Okay, let me search jock outfit. Let's see what comes up, if anything even comes up. What the heck? Why does a maid outfit come up? That literally makes no sense. Oh, we got some varsity jackets here. That would be a cute outfit. This is a Riverdale outfit, and it's not really part of the Brookhaven spirit. Ooh, this is kind of cool. They have the actual 3D varsity jackets for the boys. Oh my gosh, he looks so big and bulky. Maybe 
as she's all his muscles shining through, I don't know. I think it's kind of cool, though. It's more of an oversized look. I'm digging it. And he is supposed to be a jock, so it kind of makes sense. Ooh, I like the black one. Oh, yeah, this is way cool. Definitely up Josh's alley. Okay, I'm gonna get this jacket, but I'm definitely gonna need an undershirt, too. I think we should just have a classic white t-shirt underneath. Something like this, or is that too boring? Oh, my gosh, we can do a tank top like this one. This is like a muscle tee. Ugh, oh, boys in their muscle shirts. I think it's gonna look really good under the varsity jacket, though, so we're getting this. And then for the pants, I feel like we need some sick jeans for this boy. Okay, these might be a little bit too gothy and grungy. Wait, is there Hello Kitty on there? Is this girl pants? How am I supposed to tell if they're girl or boy pants? I literally can't keep up. Oh, these ones say boy baggy. These pants are still a little bit too aggressive for me. I feel like since he's like a preppy jock, he needs like jeans. These are definitely girl jeans and if he wore those, he would definitely get made fun of. So maybe not. These light ripped jeans could do the trick. Are these skinny jeans though? Because boys in skinny jeans, it just kind of freaks me out. I don't know what it is. I'll just give these jeans the benefit of the doubt and assume they're not skinny jeans, so I'm gonna buy them. What else do boys like to wear? He could wear headphones, but these headphones are definitely not the vibe. He could also wear glasses. I mean, glasses make you look pretty cool, right? Ew, he looks like a spy. Definitely not a jock. <gasps> we could use a duffel bag. I feel like jocks always have a duffel bag. You know, like those hockey boys, they're always carrying a duffel bag with all their hockey gear in there. I literally know nothing about boys, so I feel like I'm just making all of this up. Maybe I'll just find him a backpack. It feels more appropriate for a school setting. Man, the boys' backpacks definitely aren't as cool as the girl backpacks. The girls' ones are way cuter. But maybe the boys aren't really going for cute. Backpack's cool and very boring and lame, but I think that's what guys like. This one doesn't even have straps on the front. Just hangs on your back like that. Straps are going into his body. Or should I get like a killer teddy bear backpack? Oh! This one down here is so cute. I want this backpack. Oh, it's a Valentine's Day backpack. Okay, I am getting way too sidetracked. Josh would literally never wear this backpack. What about this one? This one's kind of cool. Let me try it on. Oh my gosh, why is it so thick? It's bigger than Josh. Literally takes up his whole entire body. Yeah, okay, maybe not. Ooh, this is a luxury backpack. I mean, it looks pretty chic just sitting on his back like that. It has no straps, but maybe just like Velcros onto his back. Seems very impractical, but we're gonna buy it anyways. Now, since he's a jock. I feel like I'm gonna get him like a basketball or something. They have a basketball hoop? Wait, does it turn your body into a hoop? Oh my gosh, you put your head in the basketball hoop. Okay, that's just nuts. They don't have very many basketball options. Wait, this one is 2,000 Robux? A basketball head? Oh my god, it's so big. It's an XXL basketball head. I can't believe people are actually buying this thing. I mean, I would if I had that many Robux, but I don't, so I'm not. But this basketball over here seems a little bit more in my price range. I don't want it to go in my head, so I don't know where this is going. Oh, he just holds it just like that. That's perfect. That's amazing. Okay, we're so buying this. Now he's gonna be an ultimate jock. You think he needs the basketball shoes too? I mean, they could be a must. Are these what basketball shoes look like? Kind of look like bowling shoes to me. I don't know if I'm crazy. Wait, what the heck? They just follow you? It's like a ghost following right behind you. Why don't they put the shoes actually on your feet? That makes literally no sense. I don't know if there's a glitch going on with this, but I am not here for it. Okay, I think Josh is all ready to be dressed up like the jock he is. <laughs> Wow, okay, I literally look like the perfect school jock. I look like a chick magnet. Okay, let's go to school. Maybe I'll even run into my crush, Josh. Oof. Okay, good. I think the coast is clear. Oh, hey, are you new here? What's your name? My name's, uh, John. John, cool. There's something weird about you that I just can't quite put my finger on. Hmm, uh, not sure, bro. Anyways, John, want to be friends? Oh my gosh, if I become friends with Josh, then I can get the inside scoop on who he actually likes. Uh, hello? You want to be my friend or not? Uh, yeah, of course, bro. Cool. I'm going to the beach tomorrow if you want to come hang. Yeah, awesome. I'd love to come hang. Cool. See you then. Bring your swim trunks. Oh my gosh, I'm going to the beach with Josh later. But I gotta blend in and look like one of the bros. So I gotta dress up as close to his style as possible. <laughs> Okay, I've got to get ready for the beach, and this varsity outfit is just not doing it for me. So we have to get rid of all of this, and we need to start over. Start from scratch. I kind of like Josh as a baldy. He kind of looks cute. You're right. I don't know what I was thinking. Okay, I'm going to find Josh some new hair. Some more of, like, beachy boy hair. What about this one? This one looks kind of tropical to me, right? Okay, no. It looks like he just woke up out of bed. Man, this boy's hair is so messy. He needs a hairbrush to it or something. I swear, 
all of these boy hairs like literally look the same. Like look at all four of these down here. They're like pretty much the exact same. Actually, this one's kind of cute. Oh, that's really cute. It's kind of like surfer boy hair. I love that. Honestly, this one would be perfect for the beach. I love this for Josh. We're buying it. What else would a boy wear to the beach? I mean, boys don't even wear shirts, do they? They just wear swim trunks. Ooh, some Aloha swim trunks. This would be Josh if he was going to Hawaii, but unfortunately, he's not going to Hawaii. He's stuck in Brookhaven, so I don't know if this is gonna work. I like the red floral swim trunks. They look like little starfishes on his pants. Why does his pants start so low? I feel like they need to start up here a little bit. Like, they need to cover their belly button. I don't understand. The ducky swimming trunks. I feel like this is something Josh would definitely wear, but he'd be too ashamed to show anyone. Should we make Josh, like, super ripped? I mean, honestly, maybe he is super ripped. He does work out and go to the gym a lot. Josh wears a blue Hawaiian swim shirt all the time, so maybe if there's any shorts... <gasps> what about these ones? Oh, this is perfect. This is, like, just like his everyday shirt he always wears. No, literally, that's amazing. I wish his pants were higher. Why is he low riding all the time? Oh, maybe it's just a girl thing. I will buy them for him. Josh is for sure gonna need a floaty. Should I get him the dolphin? Ooh, this one would be so much fun to use in the water. <gasps> the dolphin goes right on his back. He is ready for the beach. Do you think he needs a towel? Do you think he's gonna go into the water? I mean, yeah, how can you go to the beach and not go into the water? The heck? Why does it just go in his shoulder? Oh, wait, this isn't a towel. This is a floaty. I mean, I don't think Josh can swim, so this might be a good option. Okay, fine. I'll get him the water wings. I'm gonna get him one for each arm, though. His fault for not knowing how to swim. And then I'll get him a big circular floaty to go around his waist, just to be extra safe. You never know how strong those pads can be. They can pull you under there. They don't even have any life jackets, do they? <gasps> they do have a life jacket. This looks like a pretty heavy-duty life jacket, though. I think they're just going to the beach to hang out. I don't know if it's gonna be this intense. He'll also need some sunglasses, though, because the sun can burn your eyes, okay? I was told that when I was little. I don't know if that's a fact, but I will still believe it, and I will believe it for the rest of my life. These glasses are really cool. Cool boy glasses. Oh, these are perfect for Josh. He's gonna be rocking the shade. They're Denzel Curry's round frames. I have no idea who Denzel Curry is, so yeah. We're gonna buy it anyways, though. What about a hat at the beach? He can't be burning his scalp, you know what I mean? He needs, like, a hat. Do boys even wear hats at the beach, or is that only, like, a girl thing? Ew, these hats are so ugly. There's not very many options here. I could get him, like, a sun hat, but it's a little girly. Yeah, he looks like a farmer. This definitely is not gonna look good on him. But I can get the cute little sun in the sky that follows him around. Look at this little sun. I'm gonna name her Sunny. Sunny, we're buying you and you're coming with us. Do boys have beach bags or is that only a girl thing? I swear, boys don't bring anything to the beach. They just hold their towels and run into the water. Oh, he can bring a beach towel just like this one. Perfect. This is literally all boys bring anyway, so I'm gonna get that. Okay, I'm gonna put on his entire beach outfit and we will see you guys at the beach. <laughs> This is so creepy. I literally look just like Josh and his friends. Alrighty, hopefully he's still at the beach. Hey, Josh. Oh, hey, John, you made it. Sick outfit. I swear I've got the exact same outfit at home. Great minds think alike. Ugh, is that Ashley over there? Oh, she's a cutie, eh? A cutie? Wait, do you like Ashley? Nah, I've got my eyes on someone else. Oh, hey, Josh. Who's your friend over here? This is John. He's new. You guys should totally go on like a date. A what? That is a great idea. Pick me up at eight. See you later. Sick, bro. You want a date with Ashley. Oh, boy. Now I've got to get ready for a date. <laughs> good luck. Oh, God. No, this is not good. Now I have to go on a date with stinking Ashley. I'm not even a boy, but she doesn't even know I'm not even a boy. Okay, this is literally the worst scenario that could have ever happened. She finds out this is me. She's gonna kill me. I'm just not gonna think about that right now. I've got to get ready for a date. Okay, we have to find some boy hair for Ashley. Ew. I don't want something shaky this time. I need something, like, slicked back. Something that I'm looking a little bit more professional, a little bit more handsome. This one's called slicked back hair, but it looks weird. Uh, no. This kind of is giving me grandpa hair. I don't know why, but it just is. What the heck is this hair? Oh, this kind of looks like a blonde Elvis. I mean, it's not the worst thing in the world. Kind of looks like he has blonde, fiery hair, though. I don't know if I like that. What about this one right here? It looks like popcorn on his head. No, 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 no. This is not the look. Oh, my gosh. What if I did, like, a blonde mullet? No, this literally looks like girl hair. Is this girl hair? No, I think this is supposed to be boy hair. This looks like when my mom curled my hair when I was like five years old. No, thank you. Okay, what about this one here? This one says it's slicked back boy hair. Ew, I hate it. I literally hate it. Is there a bald spot in the front of his head too? Oh my god, 
What about this one down here? Kind of looks like a bun on his head. This is also really, really awful. I didn't know it was so hard to find nice guy hair. Ah, what about this one? This one's cute. Oh, this one's perfect. Perfect, perfect for a night out. Much better than those last two. Now I'm gonna get him a suit. Maybe like a tuxedo. Ooh, that would be cool. Tuxedo. Boys wear those on dates, right? Ooh, I feel like it's a cool boy thing to do to wear suspenders. I feel like whenever boys wear suspenders, they just look like a spy. This is a cute tuxedo. Look, it literally says spy. Oh my gosh, all the tuxedos are spies. Oh, this one is very fancy. Wow, oh my gosh, I'm getting all dolled up for Ashley. Oh no, it kind of reminds me of a bowling person and it's really throwing me off now. <gasps> this one is cool. This one is sick and has like tattoos on its sleeves. Oh my gosh, kind of a bad boy. We're getting it. And it has matching pants down here. Oh, I mean, can it get any better? Oh, they're literally just plain black pants with black dress shoes. Oh my gosh, they have doggy footprints on the bottom. They love a man who loves a cute little puppy. Well, these pants sold me just because of the puppy prints. Maybe I'll have a rose. Can I hand her a rose? Say, hey, look at this. This is gonna be perfect. I will give her a rose. I'll be a gentleman. Wow, I would be like a really good boy. Aw, cute. The rose goes in his jacket there. Okay, that's amazing. We're still buying that. Ashley's gonna be blown away. She's gonna be swept off her feet. What about sunglasses? Like, just sitting on the top of my head. Like, just for me to look cool. They're like an accessory, you know? I mean, these sunglasses right here are really cool. The flames? Oh my gosh, I didn't even think you could see through them. They're literally just there to look cool on your face. I dig it, though. I like the look. I see the vision. Maybe I'll just dress up as Oliver and see if Ashley likes me. No, I can already tell. Ashley will definitely not like this. Hey, give him a beard. Maybe he'll look more manly. Oh my gosh, no. Now he just looks like a grandpa. Is this like a gray beard, too? Ew. Maybe he needs a belt. He needs a belt to, like, hold up his pants, you know? We don't want his pants falling down in the middle of the day. That would be a catastrophe. What the heck? This belt is holding nothing up. It's not even touching his body. These belts are pointless. We're not using that. Okay, I think he's all ready for his date. Now we just need to get him all dressed up. <laughs> Oh my gosh, look at me. I played out pretty good for a guy. I cannot believe I'm going on a date with Ashley. Oh no, I'm gonna be late. I better get going. I cannot believe how late you are. This is unbelievable. Um, I'm like three minutes late. Exactly my point. Now hurry up and go to the restaurant. I am starving. Okay, we're here. Let's go. Excuse me? You think we're gonna eat here at this dump? They literally have like the best burgers in all of town. I wanted lobster and caviar. This is the worst day of my entire life. I am so out of here. Well, that was strange. At least I didn't actually have to take Ashley out on a date. Now, in order to create her a Roblox account, we're gonna need her birthday. And since I was never invited to her birthday parties because she hates me, I don't really know what her birthday is. But I do know that she's 12 years old, so I do know that she was born in 2010. And her birthday, I don't really know. I mean, April starts with an A, Ayla, April, same thing, we'll do it. And then the date, okay, let's just go with 14, because 14 is my favorite number. Comment down below if you guys remember when my birthday is. Only diehard fans will know that. And now for the username. I mean, it should really just be Ayla the bully. Oh, that's inappropriate. What, you can't call someone a bully? I mean, she calls me a loser and a nerd all the time, so why can't I call her a bully? Ugh, this is so unfair. What about Ayla the meanie? Because she is a meanie. It's already in use. There's already someone with the name Ayla the meanie. Wait, that means there's two mean Aylas out there. Oh, God, I don't even want to think about it. What about Ayla the mean girl? Well, that's in use, and that's inappropriate. Ayla the mean girl 14, because I did make her birthday 14. That's in use, too? What about Ayla the piece of poop? I mean, she is a piece of poop. Wait, can I use that? Wait, I spelled piece wrong. You know what? Whatever. No one will even know. I literally don't know how that's appropriate, but we're gonna go with it, because it's kind of funny. And we obviously all know that Ayla is a girl, so we're going with girl, and we're signing up. <laughs> can't get over the fact you're allowed to have the name poop in your username. So here she is, Ayla the piece of poop. Now my bully does not look like this, so we need to change her outfit right now. Ayla is very pale like me, so we're gonna give her light skin. And the first outfit is an outfit that she would wear to school, and Ayla has brown hair, so we're gonna start with her hair. Ooh, what kind of brown hair options do we have? Oh my gosh, why is this so cute? If I had brown hair, I would literally style like this every single day. Like, why is it adorable? Whoa, what is this down here? A voluminous brown cinnamon buns? Oh, wow, that does not look very voluminous to me. How is this girl even supposed to see? The poor girl. <gasps> this one down here is called popular girl buns. I mean, Ayla is a popular 
color girl, so I mean, this one could really work. Eh, I don't really like it. It kind of looks like alien hair. Doesn't it? It kind of looks like antennas are sticking out of her head. What about this long hair here? I do not like that. That looks way too crazy. What the heck is going on with this hair here? Why does it look like a tail? Oh my gosh, this girl's hair is so long. It literally wraps around her body. It's gonna wrap around her body and just strangle her. And this is just plain straight hair. I mean, this one could be cute. I spoke too soon. This is definitely not cute at all. Why is her hairline so low? It's almost at my eyeball. <gasps> I literally love this hair color. Okay, ignore the hairstyle, but if I had brown hair, I would literally do this like brown blonde thing going on. It's so cute. Too bad I don't have brown hair and I can't do that though. Oh, this one's kind of cool. It's called preppy and wavy high ponytail. Normally, Ayla's got some high pigtails in, but this could be a nice mix up for her. And I don't like the way it makes her ears look. Oh, yes, yes, yes. This is the winner here. Just cute, wavy slash straightish hair. I mean, it's kind of straight in the back and then the front's a little wavy, curly going on. I love it. I think it's gonna be perfect for Ayla. Now we gotta get her an outfit and Ayla's favorite color is purple, so we gotta give her a purple outfit, obviously. I'm gonna type in purple popular and see if anything popular in purple comes up. It's kind of cute. It has little clouds on her sweater. It might be too wholesome for Ayla though. Let's check something else. I literally love this so much, but this might just be too kiddish for Ayla. I feel like Ayla is just too cool for this. The purple rubber ducky pajamas. Actually, fun fact, these are actually Ayla's pajamas. She does like to wear these all the time, but just not to school. Oh, this checkered cardigan is really, really cute. I love this one. It's really cute, but there's just something about it that's just not mean girl enough. A ding, ding, ding. Oh yes, this is it. This is the top. We needed a corset. It's like sparkly and cute and very popular girl-esque. I have no idea why it's called the softy doll fairy, but we're gonna buy it for Ayla. Now let's see if there's any purple pants that I think Ayla would wear here. Ayla loves to wear skirts, so a skirt could be an option, but there's also these sweatpants. Wait, is that a belly button ring? Ayla does not have her belly button pierced, so we're not doing that one. This looks like a cute little preppy cheerleader. No, she's a cowgirl. Oh, go off cowgirl. Ayla is definitely not a cowgirl, so we can't do that. Oh my gosh, this outfit is really cute too. I can literally see Ayla wearing this, but I'm sticking with my first top because I do think it's better. Purple scars? How the heck does someone get purple scars? Unless they were in a purple paint fight, then I don't know how this could happen. Oh, this would be a great school uniform for Ayla, but we don't have to wear school uniforms at school. We just wear normal clothes. I would love to wear a uniform at school though. Then you don't have to think about what you have to wear every day. Oh my gosh, that would be so nice. This pastel purple skirt is so cute and perfect. I mean, look at the socks. I think they're so cute. It looks like a little fairy skirt. I think it's gonna look adorable with her corset. And since this is Ayla's outfit while she's going to school, she's gonna need a purple backpack. So let's see what our options are working with here. The purple star backpack, that was really cute. Whoa, this looks like a magician's backpack or a fortune teller or someone that's about to read my mind. This one is just very basic and boring. Oh, this little cow backpack is so cute. It even has a piercing in its ear. Oh, this one is perfect and it matches her skirt perfectly too. <gasps> it has a puppy paw print on it. Oh, how can you not love puppies? We're buying this, that was an easy buy. And now she needs some hair clips in her hair. Are there any purple ones here? We can use the stars. Should we give her a hat? Wait, why does the hat say star on it? Oh yeah, this looks like a boy hat. Ayla would literally never wear this hat ever. A purple macaroon? Does this just go in your mouth? I mean, Ayla does get hungry a lot, but I don't think she's gonna be eating macaroons like this. <gasps> I love the purple bows. I think we should use the purple bows. They're a lot more in your face and out there, and I like that. I don't know if Ayla would actually ever wear these, but if I was her, I would definitely wear these all the time. And Ayla might get cold in her corset, so she might need an off-the-shoulder jacket. This would be perfect. Cute little pullover. Oh, yeah, she's gonna look adorable. Wow, she really looks like such a mean girl. This is bad. I'm literally creating an army of mean girls. Okay, now I'm gonna put the whole outfit together, and I will see you guys as Ayla at school. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I literally look exactly like Ayla. I wonder if people at school will mistake me for her. Ayla, what took you so long? And where is my Starbucks? Oh, uh, sorry, I forgot. Forgot? You know I like a venti half ice macchiato, three pumps chocolate, two pumps caramel, whipped cream, only poured with the boy's left hand, and sprinkles. That is the most extra Starbucks order I've ever heard. What was that? Oh, uh, nothing. Anyways, hurry up. I'm gonna be grumpy all day if I don't have my coffee. And we have Josh's Halloween party tonight, so hurry up and go get my Starbucks. Wait a minute, there's a Halloween party tonight? 
Oh, that is perfect. I just have to dress up how Emma would dress up for a Halloween party. Okay, we've got to get Halloween ready, which is kind of odd because we're still in September. But to each is their own. If Ashley says we have a Halloween party, we have a Halloween party. Now, I'm thinking for Halloween, Ayla should dress up as a cowgirl. I feel like that would be super cute. <gasps> Look at this cowgirl hat right here. I mean, this isn't really a cowgirl hat. It's just a hat that has cow print. Maybe we need an actual cowgirl hat. Oh my gosh, look at this purple one right here. <gasps> so cute. This is adorable. I want this. I want to be a cowgirl for Halloween now. Maybe I'll be a pink cowgirl though because purple is not really my color. <gasps> what? Look at this one. This one is sparkly. Oh, Ayla would die for this. Okay, this is literally perfect. Oh my gosh, you can hardly see Ayla's eyes. Why does that not really look like a cowgirl hat? It just kind of looks like a sun hat. I think I got too excited. It looked cuter in the picture. I think this one is the best. I'm definitely buying this one. We need to get Ayla new hair though. She needs to have like cowgirl hair, which are like pigtails or like braids or something like that. Like these braids. These braids are so cute. Cute little cowgirl on the farm. Or she could do a bun, the hair up and out of her face. A real farmer would probably have her hair like this, but not Ayla trying to look cute at a Halloween party. Oh, these pigtails are adorable. And it has a braid at the front that is so cute. Kind of looks like a headband braid. I love those. I think Ayla would love this. She would definitely wear this hair. Now we need a purple cowgirl outfit. A dinosaur shirt. That's not cowgirl. It's a dinosaur. They're different. Dinosaurs, cows, not the same thing. Should I just make her into a whole cow herself? A purple cow? Is there such thing as purple cows? Imagine. And then we would get like purple milk. Ooh, that'd be kind of cool. I feel like that'd taste good. It'd be like grapefruit milk. Ew, that's kind of gross. This shirt is perfect. It's gonna match the hat perfectly too. Oh my gosh. This is gonna be the cutest Halloween costume Ayla's ever worn in her entire life. Why am I being so nice to her and giving her such a cute outfit? She's normally so mean to me. Oh my gosh. How did I miss this? Why is this the cutest person I've ever seen in my whole darn life? It's a cow print purple person has pearls for the handle who knew being a cowgirl would be so much fun do we need little dilly dong boppers on the top of her head oh no we have a cowgirl hat we don't need those yeah i guess we don't need anything that goes on her head because our hat just covers it all purple butterflies on her face that is not even necessary at all who just wants butterflies just sitting on their face like that definitely couldn't be me cowgirl pants we need cowgirl pants wait but they need to be purple not all this pink there's so many pink outfits going on here i can't give her shorts like this i feel like it matches her shirt but it kind of makes her look like she's in like gymnastics competition she needs some like cowgirl boots like these or even like these what the heck kind of print is that is that cow print oh yes the jean shorts with the light brown cowboy boots these are a must we're buying these i wish they had purple cowboy boots but they definitely don't so we gotta work with what we got okay oh my gosh they literally have a whole cow outfit it's like half human half cow look at my tummy you can milk me like that why does it look like i'm pregnant i cannot believe milk comes out of these things it's kind of creepy oh we can even give her a cow hood. That's really cute. No, I think we should give her the cow backpack. I think this is the perfect occasion. You know, she can put all her stuff in it, like her perfume and her phone. You need something to hold all your stuff while you're at a party. Okay, I think we got our whole cowgirl outfit down for Halloween. Now we just gotta put it all together. Okay, this is perfect. This is exactly how Ayla would dress for a Halloween party. Again, why are we already going to a Halloween party if it's only September? Ayla, you are so stupid. What the you told me this was a Halloween party. Wait, I never... It's a beach party. Now you have me looking stupid in a costume. Okay, well, I never said... Just shut up. Meet me at the beach ASAP. We're gonna be late for the party. Okay, bye. Jeez, the way Ashley treats Ayla is not okay. But I guess we gotta get ready for the beach party instead. <laughs> Okay, well, clearly someone screwed up the theme of this party, but now we gotta get a beach outfit on. Now, for the beach, I want some cute brown, wavy hair. I mean, maybe not so wavy like this one. Oh, this looks like some party hair. She literally has stars in her hair made out of hair. This is some hair I would do for some crazy hair day. This one is called mermaid hair, and mermaids do live at the beach. But Ayla doesn't have that blonde streak in her hair. Also, this is a lot of hair. This would be really hot in a summer day. That's why when I go to the beach, I've gotta put my hair up. If not, I'm gonna be sweating like a pig. This one's really cute. I like the little flips at the end. That's so adorable. Maybe I'll get her a cute headband too. Oh my gosh, this is gonna look perfect. A purple bikini. We can't go to the beach without Ayla in a purple bikini. This bikini top is really cute. How come when I search purple bikini, like most of these aren't even purple? Oh, this is a purple one? <gasps> it's purple and pink. Ooh, I love purple and pink. This is a great combination. Okay, I think I'm gonna get this one. You know, it's sort of like half Ayla.
Kayla half me, which is kind of what we're doing here. Am I going to be able to find matching purple pants? Probably not. But I will do a cute purple cover-up skirt. It's kind of like a sarong. What else do you need when you go to the beach? Oh, we can get her a beach towel, a sun hat. Oh my gosh, look at this beach ball. It has purple in it. Oh, it has all colors in it. Blue and green and pink and purple. Oh, this would be a perfect beach ball for Ayla. But I don't know if Ashley's trying to have fun like this at the party. Plus, it kind of covers up her whole outfit. So maybe not for this outfit. But I will get her a cute beach towel. You can't show up to a beach party without a beach towel. That's just like illegal. I should get her a sun hat though. I feel like that's very important to block your head from the sun. <gasps> Look at this cute purple one. Oh my gosh, why is this so wholesome? I feel like with this hat, I'm living in a cottage. I want this hat. I need this hat in real life, but I want a pink version of this hat. As you can probably figure out, pink is my favorite color. And of course, at the beach, you're gonna need a floaty. How else are you gonna have fun in the water? Oh my gosh, this one is so cute. It has flowers on it. Oh, say no more. This is a done deal. This is an easy purchase. The description, I love summer. Me too, girl. That's why I'm buying this. I'm helping you out. Oh my gosh, look at this flower basket. Wow, that is adorable. I'm shook with how cute this is. I've never seen this before. Okay, sorry, I'm getting distracted. I'm sorry. Okay, now I think Ayla is ready for some fun in the sun. Okay, I better get to the beach before Ashley freaks out on me again. Ayla, it's about time. Sorry it took so long. I had to figure out what to wear. Hey guys, sorry, party's over. My parents just got home, but yeah, have a good rest of your day. <laughs> Not worth it. I cannot wait to go back to my normal life. 